up, Brave Game? You guys already know what it is. It's your boy back at it again with another banger, man. Now, as you guys may or may not have noticed, there is a Avengers trailer that just came out um, between yesterday and today, and we have to check this out, everybody. It's been blowing all the way up, and we got to see um, exactly how lit this new trailer is for Avengers Endgame. Is if you guys saw earlier, I did a review on Captain Marvel, and I gave you guys my um, my two cents on that movie and stuff, and like what I liked, what I didn't like. Um, you guys should go check that out because it was pretty interesting. I guess a new little thing I will add about that movie is the acting was not the best, <laughs> at least for the main character. But anyways, let's hope, go ahead and get in this video. If you guys have not already, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn your post notifications, and of course. Um, let me know what you guys think, what are your predictions and everything, and let's get straight into this trailer. There will be a lot of pausing, there will definitely be a lot of pausing, because this is going to be a trailer breakdown, so if you guys aren't with the pausing stuff, you should do yourselves a favor and watch the original trailer. The link is in the description down below. Thank you guys so much for your support. If you're new to the channel, help us get to 100k. We're almost at 50k right now, so um, the next big milestone is definitely going to be 100k. So. Um, thank you guys so much, and let's get straight into this video. Yeah, it seems like a thousand years ago. We got a close caption. I fought my man. Oh my god. Out of that cave. Became Iron Man. Dude, that is sick. That is sick. This is actually an interesting reference, too, because this helmet, uh, this damaged helmet, was also from the, the first trailer that, that, that they had for. Avengers Endgame, man. They opened up with this, him in the space pod. Yes, I loved you. I know I said no more surprises, but I was really hoping to pull off one last one. Oh, this must be uh, Captain America uh, over here. It says United States Armed Services Recruitment. That can only mean one thing. That's clearly Captain America. The world America. has changed. That's crazy. Is, is that his daughter? Oh, what? That's crazy. For some reason, I thought that. Oh, I'm thinking I'm getting X Men mixed up. I mean, did his daughter die? But that was actually like uh, I'm thinking of Magneto and his family and blah 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 from like the latest movie and whatever. But uh, I'm completely two different series. <laughs> we can do is our best, and sometimes the best we can do. Oh, that's crazy. That's Hey, my question is, who is in that casket? Who is in that casket? Because that does not seem like an old, like, uh, you know, uh, an old scene. That seems like like uh, something that's happening um, in the movie or whatever. I mean, I can't remember. It, it, and if that is somebody that's died already, I can't quite remember who it was. But in that casket, who is that? Because there's a lot of people. I'm going to go kind of rewind it and stuff because I think I see, is Bruce Banner one of those people? No, it's just him. That's crazy. I wonder who's in that casket. I I have I, I watched all the Marvel, uh, all the Avengers movies up to this point. So this could be a flashback or who knows. Yeah. Thor. Yeah. I saw these Black Panther man. He's like, this is no place for for uh, anyone to die, and then he dies. And I'm like, damn, I was so taken back, bro. When I saw like Black Panther was one of the guys that was erased, I'm like, what? He just had a movie like a few weeks ago. What the hell? That's crazy. That was, that was, that was crazy. I keep telling everybody I shouldn't move on. Yeah. Some do. Some don't. Some do. Some do. Small chance. Yeah. Know this. Everyone who's not in this room. This movie is going to be so intense, you guys. I heard rumors that this movie is going to be three hours long. If that is true, this is going to be the most lit Marvel movie that's been released thus far. 
going to have a, a lot of action, hopefully. It's playing off of Infinity War, so the story is already really good. I just hope that some new characters that are introduced in this movie don't take away from the movie and um, bring it down a little bit. But uh, I don't know. That's all we. That's all I can really say. So far, man, like it, this is looking really like it's like 2019 is looking like the golden year for movies. There's a lot of really good movies coming out. To try. Oh wow. Oh, this is sick. This is sick. Thor with his battle axe, yo. I'm telling you, he's going to dominate. Dominate. <laughs> Yo, I remember somebody was like, uh, uh, Scar oh, what was it? A Black Widow shoots at Thanos. Thanos looks like uh, Black Widow. Am I a joke to you? <laughs> Bullets aren't gonna do anything to him. Maybe his minions, but I don't know. I mean, I don't know. I feel like Black Widow is like the female version of Batman. Like, there's only so much you can do. She's smart, but there's only so much you can actually do because. I mean, she's like wholeheartedly human. There's nothing like super powered about her, but uh, she has her own, at least martial arts skill set that can carry her for a while. But I mean, yo, if you fight demon beasts and stuff like that, it might be a quick rap, man. <laughs> and man. Whatever it takes. Yes. The new Avenger suits, man. They're going back into outer space. They're going back into orbit, unless they, uh, I'm pretty sure they're going to take the fight to Thanos, for sure, for sure, because, I mean, Captain Marvel's in this. Captain Marvel. I don't know. That scene right there is kind of random. I'm not sure why they put that in the trailer. That's so random. Like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> that doesn't make no sense. But uh, whatever. I, I, I'm going to go speak on it. I like this one. <laughs> okay. Well, that was the trailer breakdown. Um, we are going to discuss this actually. So we watched uh, the trailer, kind of talked through it a little bit, and then we're going to make some closing remarks and stuff for this trailer. So um, I have my predictions, my set of predictions. I'm going to kind of list those. There's no spoilers because obviously I haven't seen the movie yet. But um, there's a lot going on, guys. There's a lot going on. We have uh, Hawkeye. Uh, he wasn't really a super huge proponent in the last Avengers movie, in Infinity War. He wasn't really out there like that. Um, I mean, I, and if he was, I think he was on the field with a lot of the other guys. Actually, he was out there for a little bit, but um, there were some people who weren't, like, they didn't play as big of roles, right? But now you have a team of Avengers that's willing to, like, you know, go the extra mile and dominate and stuff like that. So it's going to be really interesting. I want to see how they find Thanos, and I'm pretty sure how they find Thanos is through Captain Marvel and exactly how they beat him. And I feel like how they beat Thanos has everything to do with the Tesseract because if you guys, spoiler alert, watched Marvel, Captain Marvel, um, the lady who invented the Tesseract said that she invented it to um, to end all wars, to end all wars. And technically it's like an all out war on one man. And that man is Thanos. So with the Tesseract, right, if they're able to come together collectively, fuck him up with the, the power from that, that would be incredibly insane. And I know that Captain Marvel has that power within her. So she's going to play a very huge role in that. Now, I know a lot of the people watching this might be comic, like, uh, you know, comic book driven people and whatnot. And I haven't actually seen, um, comic book, uh, I haven't read the comics like religiously like that, at least in the last like 10 years. So I've just been keeping up with just the MCU movies and stuff. And it's been awesome. Like it's been awesome every step of the way. I honestly think that this is not the last movie. Uh, there will definitely be more Marvel movies for sure, but they're going to be more spinoffs into other characters and whatnot, origin stories. I heard that Black Widow's getting her own movie. I heard Hawkeye might possibly getting his own movie and uh, other characters as well. So um, this will be a huge turn of events, guys. It's going to be very interesting this year. 
uh, to see exactly what kind of toll this takes. And I also want to see exactly what type of secret ending we're going to have for, uh, you know, this Avengers movie. Because although, like I said, the movie is supposed to be slotted to be close to three hours long, um, I Marvel is notorious for having secret endings on top of secret endings. So there is a bigger project, I feel like, that they're working on behind the scenes. And an even bigger villain, I want to say. Um, that's assuming that they kill Thanos. Now, if they don't kill him, then there's clearly going to be more movies. But if they don't, then, uh, or if they do kill him, then, you know, you know, I'm not sure who the next big villain is going to be. But let me know what your thoughts and feelings are in the comments down below, Bray Gang. You guys are on here. We're trying to build a, a tough community and everything, like a really tight community. Uh, definitely hit me up in my Discord. I have that in the comments down below, or not, the, not only the comments, but in my description down below. It's one of the first links in my description. Thank you guys so much for watching, um, and definitely subscribe to the channel. Help us get to 100K. Work us, or I guess we're at, to an edit a decent pace. We're, per, we're approaching 50K right now, so that's a pretty big accomplishment, and we're definitely going to celebrate once we hit 50K because we're at the halfway marker and uh, go from there. But anyways, thank you guys so much for your love and support. Until the next time, I see you guys again. Take care. Peace.